Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 22nd. So what I want to say is let's talk. Let's talk. Let's talk about this. So what do you want to talk about? Everything. What's next? Seven of Cups. Seven of Cups is about choices. Thinking. Thinking about the options. Somebody's definitely thinking about what's next. What they should do. There's definitely multiple choices here. <sighs> hmm. What is the best option? What should I do now? What do we do now? What do we do now? There's a need to make a decision, need to make a choice. There's, there's plenty of options here. Ooh, King of Cups reversed. Nine of Swords. Three of Wands reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. Strength reversed. Oh my God, and no, as you can see, my deck is not upside down. You may be stuck in some old age mindset that things have to be done a certain way, but that is not the case. I'm unique. Not like anybody else. Get that through your head. So, we got a lack of clarity here. We have a lack of clarity. There's a lack of mental strength. We have somebody here that isn't communicating the truth. They're not being honest. They may not be honest with themselves. Very, very worried. Uh, worried about something. Uh, Seven of Swords reversed. That is coming back. Uh, sneakiness. Um, there's some outdated thinking here, which I just told you there was. So we got somebody here that is, is definitely not, they need to look at things from a new perspective. Uh, there's a lack of foresight here. We got somebody here that is staying in the past or they need to change their thinking. Um, King of Cups reverse. This is uh, emotional withdrawal, not following the heart. Uh, uh, there's definitely a lack of, of mental strength as well. Lack of strength, lack of courage. Could be some fear here. Fear of opening the heart. Fear of getting the heart hurt, right? Well, yeah, that's a real fear, isn't it? Um, three of Wands, reverse, unprepared, lack of foresight, uh, stuck in the present, unable to focus on the future. We got somebody here that is really stuck in an old way. It's funny how this shit just rolls right off my tongue. Somebody's not seeing the opportunities. They're not. Because they're in some sort of fantasy land. They're in some sort of illusion. Somebody's not seeing the opportunities. I think they see it. But they're not. They're not taking it. Because it's like it's there. I see it. But I don't want to see it. Right? I don't want to see it. I don't know what to do. Very, very confused. We have somebody here that is very confused. And it is their outdated thinking. You know, they're not thinking about a better future, a brighter future. Um, strength card reversed is, is uh, feeling inadequate, perhaps. Somebody may feel inadequate. Or, with the strength card reversed, we could have somebody here that has a very fragile ego. You know, a big ego. This person is afraid of getting their ego hurt. Um, but that Seven of Swords reversed, it feels, that Seven of Swords reversed, that is a, I don't know, a warning of some sort. Uh, 
hermit reversed. I wonder if somebody is hiding something. <laughs> Coming back. Somebody is hiding. They're hiding, but it feels like they are going to come back. Somebody may be coming clean, or they may be thinking about coming clean, but they might not be able to because they don't have the mental strength to do so. Um, I feel like there's fear of rejection. There's fear of rejection that is holding somebody back from uh, choosing a better option. It's like there is a better option here, but there's there's fear. There's definitely, I feel like there's fear of uh, being turned down or something like that. Very, very worried, anxious, regretful. We have somebody here that is regret regretting something. There's dishonesty for sure. We have a very cowardly individual that is not communicating uh, their feelings or something like that. The King of Cups reversed is somebody that is closed off emotionally, secretive, withdrawn, non-communicative. And then the Ace of somebody's not communicating. They're not communicating. And they're, they're ha they may be feeling guilty or they may be having some regrets. I don't know. Let's talk about the future. Let's talk about the future. Emperor. Emperor. So this is somebody who does take charge. A very, uh, this is an individual that is very uh, masculine, uses their head, is very rigid on the outside, you know, very distant. Uh, this person shows no weakness. So we have somebody here that has a very tough, tough exterior that doesn't like to show any type of weakness whatsoever. This could be um, a business owner. This person may own their own business. Could be somebody that's in a managerial position. Father, uh, this is like a um, very structured individual who does not like to show weakness. But it feels like this individual is, I feel like this person is feeling inadequate. They may be sick. They may be paranoid. They are, uh, they could definitely be paranoid. They're not really communicating their feelings. They're holding it in. Somebody is holding in how they really feel. Feel. Um, this is somebody that is very decisive, very, very experienced, has a lot of life experience behind their back, uh, likes to have a plan before they, they leap, typically. Um, this, this, this person um, takes control. This may be a father or, like I already went through, I'm not going to go through it again takes takes the lead somebody is is sitting in a really good position as well this is a leader that is getting ready to take action this guy's going to do something he is going to do something okay um I'm not sure what he's going to do what is he going to do that strength card reversed though that's weak that's lack of confidence low self esteem could be sick Justice. Now, this is about doing the right thing. I'm not sure if we're, we got a judge here. This is a ruler, a decision maker. Somebody is sitting in a place where they need to make a decision. They need to do the right thing. They need to be honest with themselves. So somebody is, is probably having a hard time making a decision, but it is decision time. That very first card is about a choice. It's about making a decision. So we have, a, we have somebody here that is really, really thinking about their options or thinking about their choices. I think they may have missed an opportunity you know, or something like that. They may have missed an opportunity. They may have stayed in isolation for quite some time or they restricted themselves or something. They may have been lying to themselves or, or in some sort of denial or something like that or just not seeing it's confused you know somebody here that's been confused and there is some sort of guilt feeling guilty feeling ashamed or regretful for for something for not telling the truth somebody may be feeling regretful for their actions something like that this person takes charge makes a decision maybe something about a contract or to do the right thing or to come clean or to be honest because this is about honesty justice is about honesty this is also consequences and uh, making a fair and just decision being honest and upfront so somebody is going to be honest and upfront 
Um, there's been some sort of lies, okay? There has, but that Ace of Swords reverse, somebody hasn't been telling the truth, and they're feeling guilty. They're feeling guilty for not telling the truth, maybe having a hard time sleeping. It's like it's a plague, right? Um, the Emperor takes charge to bring balance to a situation. This is about balance. It's about doing the right thing. This is also a card of karma, a justice card. So this is doing the right thing, making a judgment call of some sort. I know it's not judgment, it's justice, but I feel like we have somebody that is in a position of authority that has to make a decision. I do feel like it is a masculine, okay? I know I got a lot of women out there that want to put themselves in this position, and I'm sure a lot of you will, but I feel like it's a masculine energy. Just say it. Anyhow, um, this masculine is making a decision. This is a masculine energy. And I know a lot of you want to put yourself in that position. I see it. I feel it very heavily. Oh, it's me. <laughs> I don't care if you like me. I really don't. Anyhow, um, I really, really, really don't. So, um. justice about bringing balance to a situation doing what I got to do I got to I got to I got to do the right thing somebody is about do, about to do the right thing hopefully um something about a contract to there's two sides to everything with the Justice card. Somebody is seeing the, the other side. They're starting to see the other side of something. Oh, this is a message you don't want to hear. A conflict, a mild conflict. There's some sort of conflict of some sort. Maybe with a child, I'm not sure. Page of Swords reversed. That's difficulty in communication. Unexpected conflict. There is some sort of unexpected conflict here. Could be with an individual that says something without thinking. You know, that, that opens up something. It's like something gets said that bring some sort of truth, bring some sort of clarity, you know, gives something gets said by somebody. It feels like it's by mistake or something. Um, page of swords reversed. <laughs> Message you don't want to hear. Mental, some sort of golden opportunity. Somebody has received some sort of communication or message or information from an individual that I feel like whatever this news is has made them feel conflicted about their decisions. You know what I mean? It's like there's this news or this information has uh, revealed some sort of truth Okay, it's revealed some sort of truth, and now there's some sort of despair over the truth coming out, whatever that means to you. Okay, there is a new golden opportunity here. Okay, somebody is going to be going down a new path. This is, this is something abundant. This is a time of abundance and a prosperity. This is a new beginning, a new opportunity. A golden opportunity comes from somebody's Oh, conflict. There's like a message, but this, this message opens up a new path. It opens up a new door. So a new doorway is opening. This is like a blessing. This is reality. This is a reality check. We have in somebody that really is having a very hard time communicating. They are. They're having a hard time communicating their truth. They may have a lot of regrets or their fear or something like that. They're having a very hard time. But I feel like there is going to be some sort of 
justice or truth that comes out because I feel like we have an individual that is ready to fight because the emperor is, is a leader, takes the lead. Somebody is ready to fight for justice. They're ready to fight for uh, balance or what they deserve or something like a golden opportunity. This is, I mean, the Ace of Pentacles is like when the God gives you an opportunity for long-term stability. It's like the power is in your hand. This is a gift. Do you want it or not? You're going to give it away? You're going to throw it away? Somebody may have missed the opportunity already or in the past or something like that because they were lying to themselves or they felt inadequate or their ego was in the way or something like that. Who knows? Anyhow, um, there is definitely a masculine energy here that is going to be uh, taking action. This guy is going to take action masculine energy okay this person is ready to take responsibility for their actions ready to accept responsibility going to do something um, well this is no toleration for lies do something honest it really is Justice is about honesty. It's about doing the right thing. It's about being honest, telling the truth. Somebody's about to speak some sort of truth, but there's some sort of, well, the page of swords reversed that is caught off guard. Somebody may be caught off guard by this news that comes in, you know, or they may have received some news that catches them off guard. It's, it's probably conf conflicting information. It makes you feel conflicted. Whatever, whatever news this is may make you feel uncomfortable. You may feel like, oh my God, where the hell is this coming from? That kind of thing. Anyhow, Ace of Pentacles is a new opportunity. Somebody manifested it. It's a yes answer. It's a new solid opportunity for abundance. Okay. Um, it's a gift. Somebody may get approved for something as well. You could get approved. That could be an approval. Um, mm, Knight of Pentacles reverse. So not, this is, oh, that ain't good. That Knight of Pentacles reversed is delay. Stopped. Somebody has been delaying. They've been procrastinating. There is some sort of not no long-term plan. Somebody that is inflexible here with that with that very very stubborn. We have a very stubborn energy here. Who this is unplanned. It's unplanned. I don't. I wasn't planning on this. I wasn't planning on this offer. Somebody. It's unplanned. It's unplanned. Somebody is getting an unplanned offer. They may not want the responsibility. It's like, no, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for this. I wasn't expecting this. It's totally unexpected. Somebody is getting an unexpected offer from somebody. Um, Knight of Pentacles reversed. Stop. I just want to say stop. Just stop. Stop talking. <laughs> stop talking. Oh my God. There could be a difficult conversation that is coming. Just saying. Um, Yeah, sudden arrival, sudden departure. Um, delay. Delay again. So there's been some sort of delay. There could be more of a delay. There's lies being exposed. I believe there's lack of planning. Again, lack of planning. Somebody didn't plan. They didn't plan for this change. You have somebody here that didn't plan for this to happen, but it's happening. It's happening, whatever it is. Suddenly, a sudden arrival, sudden change. We have a sudden change here. It's unplanned. So somebody is suddenly changing their mind. They were stuck. They were stuck. Now they, they, wanna, they want balance in their life. They want to do the right thing. Whatever that means. Whatever the right thing is. Somebody is... is uh, uh, Going to be following their heart. Expressing their feelings. 
opening their heart, showing feelings. Somebody's going to be expressing their feelings after procrastinating, after not telling the truth, after not communicating. I don't know who this person is. Um, whoever this person is, they have a lot of life experience behind their back. And they have a very tough exterior. And they don't like to show their feelings. They like to, they like to remain rigid. Okay, They like to remain in control at all times. But I feel like this person is can't really restrain themselves at this point because they're being poked but they are they're being poked poked by karma justice i don't know the truth their fears they're being poked they can't sleep they're, it's just plaguing them i don't know who this person is it could be a father figure it could be a i don't know i don't know who it is it doesn't have to be a father it could be a boss not that a boss would do something like that but this person may be in a managerial position or whoever they are this person is somebody that is in a position of authority and they're about to take action they are this person is ready to fight for something that they think that they deserve or they think that that it that you know is theirs or something like that they're about to fight for they're about to do the right thing as well with the justice card um they're about to uh this is very sudden very very sudden so there is going to be a message that comes through that may leave you tongue-tied it may, it may leave you tongue-tied. You may have no words. You may have no words for this message when it arrives. This is a golden opportunity. It could lead to success. It could lead to prosperity. And it could lead to abundance. Okay, this is something that you can take to the bank. Okay, it's something that can grow into uh, something big. Okay, something wonderful. But you you won't be able to procrastinate. You'll have to run with it. And I mean run with it. You know, you have to trust it and have faith. Anyhow, there is a new opportunity that is coming that it's happy news, but it's conflicting news. Okay, it's it may make you be like, uh, what? Uh, I think there's definitely going to be a conversation. Okay, it's going to be a surprise. Um, somebody may be love struck as well with that page of cups. That could be an admirer. It could be a secret admirer. You know, I don't know. Uh, could be. This could go all day long and we have to stop. Um, stop procrastinating. Follow your heart. There could be a changing of a contract as well. 